Appalachian Wireless now has new forward pay pricing, where you can pay up front and get the data and features you desire. Five gigabytes of data, just $39.99. Unlimited, just $79.99. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. The students weren't in class, but teachers at Pike County Central High School stood together along Route 119 Monday morning to protest Senate Bill 1, which, if passed, will drastically change how their pensions are structured. At my age, I'm ready to retire, and so I'm wondering exactly what's going to happen to my pension. That's one of the big sticking points that I have with this bill. Um, and I'm also concerned I have a granddaughter that's just now starting into teaching. What's that going to do to her? She is doing her student teaching right now, going into education, and I wonder what kind of future it's going to hold for her. One notable component of Senate Bill 1 reduces the annual cost of living increase in retirement checks for teachers from 1.5 percent to 1 percent and raises the amount of time teachers who have taught less than 20 years must remain in the classroom. Now with those years of 27 years of service, now we would have to increase it or we would have to go um, for um, a reduction. That's the, I mean, that's the part about it. It is, like I said, at age 60, I will have 33 years of service in, and that wouldn't get me full retirement. The teachers at Pike Central mirror the statements of other educators across the state, saying the proposed changes are not what they agreed to when they took the job. We have paid our money in, and we should be able to receive it when we get ready to retire. Don't change the rules mid-game. We signed a contract, and they need to honor that contract. Pike Central teachers say they will continue to wear red in solidarity every Wednesday until an agreeable resolution is found. At Pike County Central High School, I'm Shannon Deskins, EKB News.